Hi, everyone. The main topic for this video is to teach you how to assemble this soft-lying hyperbaric chamber. Soft chamber is popular for home usage because of the foldable design. After we took all the accessories from the cartons, we can start to assemble the hyperbaric chamber. We can put the chamber body on the foam base first. These holes are for connecting the chamber body with concentrator. Let's take the tube connectors to install it. Usually, we will prepare extra connectors for spare usage. We just need to screw it to install it. Same installation way to all tube connectors. You can determine the connector location based on your needs. If you install the tube connector and you don't use it now, you can use chalk plug to block it to avoid air leaking. The black one is the chalk plug we prepared for you. Actually, it is similar to the stopper which avoids air leaking. If the chamber you received didn't install the stopper, let's show you. This is the hole looking for the stopper. For the hole we don't use for now, we use stoppers to block it. Just screw it tightly to avoid air leaking. This is the outer pressure gauge, which have extra cost. Just screw it in the connector. This is 8 mm connector for oxygen tube. We need to move the oxygen tube far away from the environment detection tube. Or the concentrator would test the inaccurate diffuse concentration. Now let's connect the tubes between the chamber and concentrator. There have 5 tubes, 2 PCS 10 mm diameter tubes and 3 PCS 8 mm tubes. This one is 10 millimeters pressurization tube. The second one is 10 millimeters pressure relief tube. The third one is 8 mm pressure detection tube. The fourth one is 8 mm cabin environment detection tube. The last one is 8 mm oxygen tube. You can see we made the oxygen tube far away from the environment tube. An oxygen tube is close to the inside chamber user's head. Let's install the inside control panel. Inside users handle the concentrator by this panel. No need for remote controller. We put the communication cable through this hole first. Inside panel doesn't T require batteries. If the concentrator had power supply, the panel could be workable. Screw the connector tightly to avoid air leaking. 
You can adjust the cable length by the cable connector, too. Let's open the zipper to install the inside panel. This is our inside control panel. There have white dots on the cable connector. Align the connector with the white dot, insert it, and tighten it. Now let's show you how to install the connector for oxygen mask. This connector connects with the oxygen tube on chamber from inside. So you need to know which one is the oxygen outlet too. Just screw this connector from inside chamber. Then we connected the oxygen mask. Just plug in it. If you want to inhale high-purity oxygen, use the oxygen mask. You can hear that the air noise inside chamber, which is lovely now. Let's show you how to install the silencer. Install the silencer connector first. This is the silencer looking. Let's plug in it on the connector. You can hear that the noise disappears now. The function of silencer is to keep inside chambers quiet. That's all steps to assemble the soft chamber. It is not complicated, right? Turn on the machine and set up the pressure. Enter the chamber and close the inner outer zipper. Then you can enjoy your oxygen therapy. Some clients may ask how to maintain the concentrator. When you receive the package, you may find to do for PCS air filters. After using the concentrator for 1,000 hours, the machine would remind you of replacing the air filters. Let's show you how to do. Take off the machine back cover and replace it.